What's up, everybody, and welcome to Clown Live! This is an Amazon Live interactive shopping experience presented to you by Shopping Dragons. What up, though? I'm your host, Dragon Blaker. You can call me Blake. How's everybody doing today? It's been 24 hours since we last visited each other. I was live yesterday at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and we are back right now doing it up Thursday. It's almost Friday. I'm so stoked for the weekend. <clears throat> And uh, yeah, but it is Thursday today. It's 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's 10 p.m. Zulu time. I hope everybody's doing great. Hello, Robin Luker. What's up, Rover? Thanks for joining us today. How's my back? Uh, my back's all right. My back is like I give it like uh, I give it like a five percent. I feel it. I feel it like five percent. So I'm doing pretty good today. But uh, usually, if you see me bouncing around, I'm usually just shifting weight from leg to leg constantly. But I feel great. I feel good. Everything is feeling wonderful. We don't have a lot of heavy objects behind us, products today to lift up, to talk about. So I don't think it's going to be a big deal. Uh, thank you. Thank you for showing concern about my bad back. It does hurt sometimes. Today, I'm feeling great. What's up, Jennifer Lude? Thanks for joining us here on the show today. <clears throat> got a short nap in. Uh, what did I do? What did I do? Well, we got the new desk. We talked about the desk yesterday. And it's on wheels, so um, I, ro I rolled it in front of the couch right here, <clears throat> and I sat in front of it. Uh, I sat in front of the desk on the couch, and it felt pretty baller, okay? And then I realized that I could move the desk a little bit really easily and uh, put the recliner up and not touch anything under the desk, and that's even at its lowest setting, so that was pretty baller, and I ended up just kind of like choosing to pass out in front of the computer on the couch. It was great. And then, I don't know, I guess I got up at probably, I don't know, maybe 3 o'clock in the morning and went to bed. And I got up today, I suppose, around just before noon. I've been Me getting up just before noon is absolutely sleeping in, and uh, usually I get up like around 10, 10.30. But yeah, I woke up at 11 and I'm like, I'm just going to sleep a little bit longer. And then I woke up and it was noon. So uh, whatever. I don't have a problem sleeping, but I do like to spend time with Mima before she heads off to work. So every moment that I'm asleep is a moment that we don't get to hang out, right? <clears throat> anyway, that was how my sleep went. And then, uh, yeah, everything else has been chilling. I just set up the show today. I watched some YouTube videos. I, uh, I watch Ice Poseidon and... This man is, he went, if you know anything about Ice Poseidon, he went to Japan. He's starting IRL streaming in Japan and uh, he's popular. So he's getting like every $1 donation adds a minute that he will stay live. And he's been live 
for at least three weeks, almost a month. He must have been in Japan now, just constantly streaming, always live. It's really crazy. So I check in on that from time to time. I was watching that today before the show started. <coughs> Excuse me. But, yeah, I mean, that's it. Didn't do too much. Didn't do very, very much uh, at all. I got some new packages. They're sitting over here on the uh, on the kitchen counter. We got some new kitchen stuff that we're going to talk about at a later date. So that was really cool. I love uh, opening up boxes, and I'm like, oh, what got delivered today? So that's really fun as well. Okay, what's up, Arlene, and hello, Cody, and uh, Robin, you were here. What's up, Bart? I don't mean to shun you. I'm just saying new people that I haven't greeted. Uh, what's up, Cody and Bart and uh, Evans? What's up? Thanks for joining the chat. We are just getting the show started. I've been relaxing. John K., thank you for following. Welcome to Clown Live. I am Dragon Blaker. You can call me Blake. You can call me whatever you like, but uh, I really appreciate that you hit that follow button, and now that we got a new follower... <clears throat> let's talk about today's thought. Let's drink some water. Okay. Let's moisten our throats. <clears throat> and uh, let's talk about today's giveaways. We got a $5 Amazon gift card giveaway happening on today's show. It's going to happen near the end. It's going to happen at the end of today's show. We try to do the show, John, in about two hours. Okay. So, uh, Sometimes we run late. Very often we run over the two-hour time mark, but that's okay. We love hanging out on Amazon Live, not only consuming the content, but also creating it, and that's what I love doing here now. So once again, thank you for following, and as a thank you for all of our followers on the show, we always offer them the ability to win a $5 Amazon gift card on every episode of Clown Live, and that is no exception today. So head over to the website that Rover just put in the chat. It's shoppingdragons.com slash win, okay? Head over there, enter the form, put in your email address, <clears throat> follow our other social media on that form. It's very helpful to us. And then come back here, hang out for a little bit. We're going to talk about some new products. We got new products. Look, this is new. Uh, this is new. Uh, this is new. There's a whole bunch of new stuff today. And, uh, yeah, we're going to talk products. And then at the end of the show, we're going to have a fun clown race with a roll call. So make sure you're here to do the roll call, the roll call. If you're unfamiliar, what's up, Randy Dresden, the roll call, John, if you're unfamiliar, okay, is just our moderator Rover is going to put a word in the chat. And all you have to do is say the word, copy and paste the word, however you want, put it in the chat. That's the roll call. We'll enter you into a list, and then we're going to run that list through a clown race. Clown race is going to be fun. It's fun every show because somebody wins money. And I didn't forget that uh, tomorrow we're going to give away two $5 gift cards. We're going to give away one for first place and one for 17th place. So don't let me forget that I said that. Sometimes I can be forgettable even though I'm remembering now. So that's going to be great. But yeah, John K, like I was saying, thank you for following. Head over to that website. Enter for our $5 Amazon gift card. And while you're there, head to shoppingdragons.com slash win100 and enter for Shopping Dragons $100 Amazon gift card or PayPal cash payout giveaway. That's happening as well. If you win, you get the choice. You get the choice of how you want to be paid. So that's ultra dope. Okay. And then, uh, Rover, if you could go ahead and put the links for the other giveaways. There's so many other giveaways that are happening right now at uh, dragonblogger.com. There's a whole giveaway tab there. They're giving away a MetaQuest 2. They're giving away, I think, a $50 cash gift card right now. Um, they're, they're Dragon Blogger, who is the partner with Shopping Dragons. Okay, they're the same thing. <clears throat> partnered up with vast.gg dragon blogger partnered up with vast and they're giving away a steam deck that's happening that ends in a couple of days so make sure you head over to those websites and uh um what if we only have 16 runners um i don't know i don't know if we okay here's if we only we i feel confident that we will have more than 16 players today OK, but if we if we only have 16 today or for Friday for Friday for Friday Rover. OK, if we only have 16, which I doubt. OK, confidently, if we only have 16, we'll just add a double. And if double hits, we'll pay double to second place. Easy, right? Sounds fun. 
Uh, okay, so with that, uh, yeah, here's all these great links, John. If you're still here watching with us, check these out. Win some prizes. And remember, when one giveaway ends here on Dragon Blogger, as well as Shopping Dragon, a new one begins. A new one begins. So there's always ample opportunities to win great things, gift cards and prizes constantly, constantly. So stick around, enjoy the show, enter the forums, have some fun if you've never been here before. And if you're still here listening to me talk to you, John K, say something in the chat. Uh, Randy Dresden, I saw you two minutes ago. I said, hey, how are you, bud? I hope you're doing great. We are going to get into some products. Yesterday, I was so excited about the new desk. <clears throat> Pardon me. Yesterday, I was so excited about the new desk that we talked a lot about it. And then I got so distracted. We ran like 40 minutes overtime. So today, I want to I want to do the show. I want to talk about products. So let's get into it. Thumbs up to the 11 people watching, all the lurkers, okay, who, uh, who are not listening. These thumbs up are for you while I'm on mute. Hello. And uh, what's up, Thor? Thank you for following. Uh, we're just getting our show started now. Um, enter for our $5 Amazon gift card giveaway. That information is scrolling here at the bottom of the page, as well as you can take links from our moderator, USS Rover. Okay, so welcome to the show. Um, and let's get started. Let's get started on the show. Uh, and we're going to start with the pluggable USB 250 time digital microscope. And I got that bad boy right here. Oh, okay. I guess I got that bad boy right here. <laughs> got to be careful. Though. They're yanking these wires. Okay. This is the pluggable USB digital microscope. This is what it looks like. It comes with this plastic plate. It's very slightly textured. It has a print on it that are some measurements and a little grid pattern. And the squares on this grid pattern are five by five millimeter square. Uh, you get centimeters on one side, inches on the other. And then there's a very smooth spot um, on the uh, on the pad, okay? We'll lift this up and pull this tab. There's a smooth spot on the tab, um, on the pad as well. Maybe reflection can kind of pick it up. There you go. Yeah? Uh, that's just to attach the suction cup, right? Which is really easy to put on. You don't need any moisture or anything. You just put it on. Use your thumb to push down this little clip, and it locks right into place. Kind of banging this. Uh... Oh, I see why. I got some wires tangled up. Anyway, this is the pluggable USB 250 time uh, digital microscope. And what's cool about it is that it has a little picture button on the top. So once you have what you're looking at in focus, you can touch this. It's just a touch. There's no button to click and it'll save a picture to where you have that pre-configured. Now the gray uh, here, it's a knob. And what it does is it facilitates focus. Now this does not auto focus. It just, if you want it closer, you got to move it closer. It just offers like a single 250 time digital zoom. Hey, what's up, Travel Diva? Thanks for popping out today. We're talking about the pluggable USB microscope right now, and we're going to do the demo like in just a second. I'm just going to cover the exterior before we cut to the camera, and we're going to look at the screwdriver bits. We got the screwdriver bits. They're ultra small, so we're going to see how precise some of those look. <clears throat> Pardon me, under the uh, under the microscope today. But I was just saying that it does have the uh, manual focus knob and you can achieve a great, sorry for banging the cord on the microphone today. You can achieve a great detail of focus with this manual focusing knob. Also, there's a dial on the front that allows you to adjust brightness levels of the four LED, oh, I keep getting caught on my microphone, excuse me, uh, of the four LEDs that are built into to the ring around the sensor, around the camera. Okay, so this is really cool. You can use this for all types of things. You can use this for anything you can think of, looking at soldering joints, okay, close-up electronics. Um, you can use this for uh, uh, looking at jewels. You can look at gems. You can look at uh, these. We're going to take a look at some screwdriver bits today. Uh, what else? I use it for horticulture. I use it to inspect plants and ensure that they are performing as they should be. It just helps you see things that you can't simply can't see with the naked eye. Okay, so without further um, ado, let's quickly switch over to the SATA screwdrivers. And we'll just talk about these real quick externally. And then we can get two products out at the same time, okay? So this is the 25-piece SATA multifunctional screwdriver kit. This is just a manual screwdriver kit. 
comes in a little plastic sealed thing. And uh, yeah, this is the kit. So when you get it, you're going to get one piece of screwdriver. Okay. And then you get 24 bits. I guess they don't count the, it's 24 bits. It's 18 in the case and six in the screwdriver. And I'll show you that right now. Uh, it just pops open like a pen. Look at the top of the screwdriver, there's this little spot, right? And you can just press the top of the screwdriver and then it pops out. So um, you can pop this out and then it pulls out. I want to be really careful. The magnets are pretty strong, but they are just little magnets holding little bits. So it's pretty cool how the bits kind of pop out when you pull them out of this pen shaped screwdriver. And then you just push them back down and press it and it locks into place like a ballpoint pen. Very cool. And then, yeah. Okay. So check this out. You get like uh, 18, um, you get 18 bits in this little compartment, uh, storage compartment or a case or whatever for these. And uh, this is magnetic. It's all right. But uh, when this came shipped to me, um, when this came shipped to me, all the bits had been jostled out of it. But I think that's expected because they shipped it like in plastic where it was open to showcase the bits. So whatever. Uh, yeah. So this isn't, um, this isn't motorized or anything. It's mechanical. We pull the bit out. You know how a screwdriver works, right? We pull the bits out. We put them in the screwdriver. We use it and then we can put them back. Magnets, right? How do they work? I don't know. But let's now switch over back. Okay. So the SATA six piece stubby screwdriver has four and a half stars. Hey, what's up, Sean Golden? Thanks for following. Yo, we are just talking about this little screwdriver right now. And then we're going to take a look at some of these really small bits up close with our pluggable USB digital microscope. So stick around for that and also get entered into today's $5 Amazon gift card clown race. That's happening today at the end of the show. Okay. Um, yeah. So what I was saying a moment ago, though, is that Let's switch. Uh, is I was telling you about the price of the uh, of the screwdriver. So the SATA six piece stubby. I don't know what it says. The the app is so small on my thing. The screwdriver kit today, the twenty five piece SATA screwdriver kit has almost five stars with almost twenty six hundred reviews. Uh, it's seven percent off on deal today. It's eighteen dollars and sixty four cents. It's regular twenty bucks. So you know, save a couple, save some, save some folding change. Get, go buy. Go buy yourself a screwdriver kit and then a coffee, okay? That'll be great. Uh, so, yeah, so that's the SATA screwdriver kit. Pretty cool. Um, I wish I could talk more in depth about the bits, but I just don't know the names of all of these special bits. And uh, we're going to take a closer look at them right now with the microscope, okay? So the SATA screwdriver is on deal today for $18.64. Now let's switch back to our pluggable USB and wrap up this product showcase. And, uh, yeah, we'll just take a look at what we got going on here. So let's open this up. We're going to open up the screwdriver uh, case. And then let's just take a look at the screwdriver case because there's a lot of bits. And then we can, you know... Um, we can, uh, sorry, I'm trying to do two things at once. Let's take a look at the bits from the top side. And then if there's anything interesting, we can look at them from the side as well. Profile shot. Okay. Now we're going to switch over to our, um, USB micro, my, um, USB microscope. I almost said microphone. And that is, do we not have it plugged in? Must have got unplugged. Yo, excuse me for a quick second while I replug the pluggable. <laughs> I must have just given a little yank today while I was trying to figure out. I believe it's this. Nope. Did I plug the pluggable in today? Yes. Oh, it's not turned on. Okay, cool. I just had to turn on my little uh, four-port EQI hub to uh, to get that popping in. Um, look, it instantly popped up. Uh, I hope you got – yeah, I can recognize that you still hear me. So let me just switch over to a camera here. And uh, we want to switch to the microscope. I would like – I would like the microscope, please. Start camera. Okay, hold on a sec.
I'm clicking all these crazy buttons and I'm just getting a little distracted trying to get these cameras to work. I see my bits with the thing. Let me check my audio setting and we are good. We're good. We're good. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah. Okay. Sorry about the delay. Okay. So let's look, this is really dark, right? And hard to see. Um, but we can turn the brightness up on the pluggable and make things a lot easier to see. Now they're mad out of focus, but that's, what's great about the pluggable is we can really get all the different, um, all the different, uh, focus that we need we can get the best focus on the on whatever we want whether we want to see the top of this bit or whether we want to focus down about a quarter inch to what to the thing you know what i mean you can get a great level of focus let's take a look at a few more bits here um okay here's some of the torx ones okay oh let's go this way to focus yeah, so we're just getting like a lot of top-down shots here with these bits, but uh, they're, they're, they're really, really precise. Okay, let's take a look at some of them on the side. We're going to move this down. We're going to move this down, and uh, let's do that. Now, remember, these, these squares, these lines, these squares are five millimeters square each. I know it's kind of out of center there, but whatever. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's pick a cool-looking one. They're hard. They are small. Let's pick the smallest one. I think that's this one. I think this is the smallest bit that comes in the kit. And I'm going to put it on the screwdriver. Look at this bit. Five millimeters square. Five millimeters, these squares. Let's do it again. Okay, that's the best we're going to get for the square, okay? So that's like a little you know, six millimeter thing, right? Look at these bits. They're so small. Oops. Look at that. These are, these look huge, but this is like not huge. Okay. It's super tiny. Let's take a look at another one real quick and then, uh, and then we'll move on from the pluggable. Let's take a look at this one. These are small, small bits, really small. I'm going to take this one off and off and show it, show it to you on the big camera when we're done here, just to show you, like, I don't know. What else do I got? Uh, let me see. I got the pen. I got the pen somewhere. Let's grab the ballpoint pen for size comparison, and then uh, and then we're going to end it, okay? We'll, we'll stop with the demo. I could just honestly, though, look at that stuff all day. Here's the pen. Here's the pen we normally show. They're all the same. Okay. Okay, so this is the screw, and then this is the head of a ballpoint pen. Let's see. So really, really small. Really, really small. And, uh, yeah, we can focus. Yeah, so we can get great focus on whatever we need to see. So really small, precise bits you get with this SATA kit. Um, and I think that's pretty cool. Really, really small bits. Okay. So what's up, Wiley? Thanks for joining. We are talking about bits and how small they are and the incredible level of detail they have. And for size comparison, we're showing a ballpoint pen. So really tiny, tiny bits. And then there's this bit too, which is kind of cool. I've never really seen this one before. They have this one, right? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, enough with the bits. Let's switch over to our OBSBOT. Why would you sleep, OBSBOT? You weren't even off that long. Uh, we're back. Okay, cool. So that's two products in one. Awesome. That was the SATA screwdriver kit as well as the pluggable USB digital microscope. Now today the microscope is on deal. It's 33% off. It has almost a five star rating with almost 6,000 reviews. It's $39.95 today. And when you click through the carousel, you can learn about more products that are offered by pluggable. Even the microscopes, they have more powerful ones. You know what I mean? 
And uh, I think I learned, somebody said in the chat a couple of days ago, I think, that before you can start seeing cells, it has to be like a thousand times magnification. So 250 times magnification with the pluggable, uh, pretty neat, pretty neat. Okay, let's move on to the next product here. Ooh, this is going to be a new product that we know. Oh, what? I can't talk about it. I can't talk about it. If it doesn't have the... Okay, let's move on to the e-meet real quick. And I'm just going to reconfirm what's going on with the products, okay? Because I just got it, and that just means that I can't show it. Um, one second. Okay, we'll check that message in a minute. Uh, what do we got on this screen? Okay, I can just watch this. Okay, perfect. Um, we're going to talk about the eMe camera, and then maybe we'll revisit the EcoFlow. There's just no price on it, so I think it's out of stock or whatever or currently unavailable, so I don't talk about things that are currently unavailable. That doesn't happen a lot on the show, so even though we've been streaming for a while, that is still a relatively new concept to me, so I just want to be sure that I'm doing the right thing. Okay, yeah, Wiley, I definitely saw you. Hello, thank you for joining the show today. Uh, I hope that your last 24 hours has been well. Uh, Ed S., thank you for joining. Okay, we just covered two products, and we're about to get into our third one. Um, okay. Okay. Uh, we can talk about it, but we'll talk about the e-meet first, okay? And then... Uh, Okay, all I got to do is just click through the product page and get the price then. I can talk about the EcoFlow in a minute, but I just got to get the price for it. So I got to click through and get it. Okay, cool. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's get back to the show here now and uh, talk about the EMI. Okay, I got the box over here. We talk about boxes on the show. I got that box right here. Really simple, simple cardboard box with a product image on it. Okay, this is the EMI C960. This is a 1080p webcam. That is pretty cool. I've got it. I can pick it up. I've got it attached to my portable monitor right now, actually. And we're going to cut to it in a minute here. <clears throat> Pardon me to see how it works. But it has a little microphone array in it. And uh, I think at least one microphone. I say microphone array because it's so long. But uh, does this have – I don't think this has speakers built into it. I never – I talk – I never have it, like, listed as an audio out device. Fixed focus, full HD, 1080p cam. I never mentioned that it was uh, speakers. I think it's just mics. Anyway, this is it. This is the product. This is the eMeet C960 1080p webcam. This is cool. We've talked about this a lot. It's got a nice uh, play. It's got a nice thing to uh, a clip on the front, right, to put on the front of your monitor, and then this back boy just folds back and and. It just sits like this, like leans uh, in place with gravity and force. Really cool. Okay. It doesn't obstruct. I put this on my portable monitor. We've talked about the portable monitor, you know. And uh, yeah, I put it on the back of that and it's just been holding very nicely. So we're going to keep it there today and we're going to cut to it in just a second. Um, but yeah, let me pick it up again. Let me pick it up again and keep talking about it. So it does have the nice grip. It has the quarter inch on the bottom so that you can screw it to a tripod. Also, uh, it has a little privacy flap that when you get the flap, it's, it's adhesive and it comes as a separate part in a bag. So you just peel a little sticky off. And stick it to the top. So it's an option if you want it on or not. I put mine on so that I wouldn't lose it. And uh, yeah, being able to close this is uh, really great. Let's cut now to the camera itself, okay? Let me get this set back up on my little portable monitor here. And uh, yeah, let's cut to this camera, okay? Let's cut to the eMeet 1080p uh, webcam. We're going to do that right now. That's this webcam. Oh, let's uh, privacy cover, privacy cover. Hello, everybody. So the privacy cover is definitely effective. And Randy Dresden is saying that the e-meet has a 5% coupon. Today, it's 10% off and it's uh, $35. It's regular. 
It's regular $38.99. Today it's $34.99. And it has an additional 5% off coupon. Thank you for telling me that, Randy Dresden. Uh, I appreciate that. But um, this is the e meet. Let's cut to the audio. We're going to switch over to the microphone on the. Oh, there's so many options here. We want to talk to the. Not the microscope. It's not this one. It should say HubSpot Yeti Array. There's so many mics. There's so many mics. Hold on. Does this this one does have the microphone built in it? Is it? I'm not sure which speaker it is. I'm not sure which speaker it is. Oh, you know, I'm picking speaker instead of microphone. I'm not sure which speaker it is. <laughs> Okay, let's get our shit. Uh, let's get our show together here. That's what I just said. I said let's get our show together. Okay, and that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get our show together. Let's drop our microphones. And so, microphone three USB microscope. No, three, not the microscope. Oh, here's the e meat man. It was hidden way down at the bottom. Okay, now let's switch over from the Yeti microphone that we broadcast from constantly over to the e meat web. To be. This can't, it should be working now. Should you hear me now? So that's the switch to the webcam. Okay, this is the EMI C960 webcam as well as microphone broadcasting the show to you live here on Shop. Oh, yeah. I'm looking at my OBSBOT. It went to sleep because we're looking at each other through the EMI. What's up, everybody? It's nice and dark. It's pretty dark. Uh, I never download, I've had this out of the box, used it like this. I've never had to, uh, download an app or anything for it and it, it just works very well it is a little bit dark but uh that's not bad it's not too bad uh especially if you have a logitech Lytra glow key light right but we don't have that in the carousel today i'm just making a fun joke okay so this is the camera this is what it sounds like <clears throat> excuse me let's now uh move back out of this shot to our obs bot okay i'll just take a quick second here um boom boom Obsbot camera, please. Thank you. And then also we should be using the microphone from the Yeti. Okay, so let's find our Yeti mic. Here it is. Okay, let's switch the microphone and we should be good. Excellent. Okay, so we're back to normal operations. The Emeet C960 uh 1080p webcam is available today for 35 bucks. It's already marked down 10% off and has an additional 5% coupon. So if you're looking for a really simple device to kick it off, I just demoed the whole thing. That's exactly what it looks like and sounds like. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Uh, I plan on incorporating. You know that I'm trying to build a bigger thing and that it takes time to build a vision. But uh, I plan on using this e camera unless something else pops up. I, I don't see why I won't incorporate this completely into the show. You know, the products that we review are worth using for the show. Right. Right. Instead of getting a bunch of. Instead of buying a bunch of new stuff, we can just demo all this stuff constantly switching cameras in and out. Dude, I can't think about the future of the show because uh, I get too excited. OK, Um Normal operation equals food bar. Uh, normal operation. We're good here. Relax, Rover. We got the OBS bot. We got the bl uh, Blue Yeti back. Okay, let's keep it moving now, uh, and we're going to go back. We're going to go back. And uh, Rover, would would you do me a favor and get me the price for the EcoFlow for this product so that I can say it? Uh, I would appreciate that. And then uh, if not, it's okay. I can open the tab and get that number myself. But while I wait, okay, for a reply... Let's talk about it. Yo, I'm so excited right now to show you the EF EcoFlow uh, uh, River 2. This is the River 2. It's not the River 2 Max. This is the River 2. This just came yesterday while we were live 24 hours ago. It still has the seal on it, and I'm going to cut it open right now for the first time. I'm very, very amped to do this. Now, admittedly, okay, I don't retain a lot of knowledge that I can articulate clearly to the audience about electricity. So today we're going to open the box, okay, and we're going to talk about like initial impressions and then we're going to slide it away 
and then we're going to learn more about it. And then we're going to try to speak in a more educated manner in the future. Okay. But okay. What is it? What is the EcoFlow River 2? Well, it's a portable battery and it's, it's a, it's a decent sized little battery. And this thing is tough. This thing is tough. We've talked about it on the show in the past, but we never had the actual product on hand. We were always showing product videos. Now we've got one here and I'm super, super stoked to show it to you. Okay. So we pop this open. Look, we've got a, a little piece of plastic. Let's pop it out. Now these, th oh man. Okay. Here it is. We pop this out. We can toss this to the side for a second. All right. Here's the device. When we open the box, uh, sorry for the scraping on the desk. I apologize. When we open the box, we've got the instruction manual as well as the product itself. Let's pull it out. Boom. There's our first impression. Wow. Let's rest it gently on the desk. And let's see what else is in the box. Doesn't look like a whole lot. We're going to have a few cables. We'll set them on the top here. And I'm going to assume that's it. That's it. Okay. There's nothing else in the bottom of the box. Okay. Cool. Yo. <laughs> yeah. I've been waiting, waiting to open this box. I knew it was coming for a while. This is the EF EcoFlow portable battery. This is the River 2. Now, uh, what you get on this is two USB charging ports as well as a USB-C charging port, a standard grounded plug, as well as a two-prong plug, and what I affectionately refer to as the cigarette lighter adapter. I'm a little bit older, so that's what I like to call it, but uh, it is just auxiliary power. Now, look, out of the box, we're going to have the, the auxiliary power, so you can charge the River 2 with this proprietary cable, okay? It's gonna plug into the back of it, okay? Where the yellow where the yellow connection is. So color-coded, easy to use. It also has a power cable to charge it. So you can charge this in your vehicle and, and keep the party going. Um, now it's been never, it's been never since I've had to tell everybody about the EcoFlow River 2. This is pretty, pretty light. I thought it was gonna be like, a little heavier than I expected, but it's really light. It's really light. It's got a great handle on it. And yesterday when we talked about this or the day before yesterday, EcoFlow put out a video where they throw it, like they throw it. They just lob it like a, like a lawn dart and just down this like crazy, like 20 stair. They throw it down a 20 stair and it just bounces all over the place. And then they plug in the lights and they're like, yo, it still works. They froze it in a block of ice and smashed it out of the ice. Now, granted, okay, it was wrapped in a plastic bag, and then they froze it in, in ice, and then they broke it out of the ice block, and they plugged it in, and it worked. They had this huge gas torch. It was like a huge torch, and uh, they were burning. They were burning their own product. They were burning the river, too, and it was getting toasty, and it was looking like crispy like a perfectly roasted marshmallow at a campfire, okay? And guess what? They plugged the stuff in and it worked. They're little test lights and it worked. It's an amazing video and it does a it, it does a way better job explaining how durable it is than what I can do verbally describing the video. They tied a rope around the handle and they dragged it behind a truck for several several uh lengths of distance <laughs> you know what i mean and it still just works so really really tough durable reliable ecoflow river 2 now that's what i can recall about it okay so we're going to learn about the electricity uh options that it offers you and how long it can charge things and what it can and what it cannot do but yo this is perfect this is great for camping okay you can plug your phones into this. You can keep your laptop going, I'm sure. Okay, a couple of times. You could probably get a couple laptop charges out of this easy. And uh, yeah, that's it. So, oh, also, also, <laughs> because it is a portable battery, um, you can click through the carousel and two, three options from two, two, nine, nine. Okay, thanks, Rover. Okay, um, what was I just saying? Oh, you can click through the carousel, okay, and go to the EcoFlow store. You can get solar panel charging for this boy, okay? So you can just keep it going. You can just keep it going. This is this is perfect for me for camping uh, as I've never had a, a traditional battery, portable battery like this before. And, uh, yeah, this is great. You can charge this up. I can put it in the truck. I can charge it in the truck. 
You know what I mean? So when we leave the campsite, I mean, I'm sure it takes a couple hours to charge it, but I can plug this in while I'm driving and go and doing things. That's great. Solar panel option to plug it in. Okay. I'm going to learn more about the appropriate way to talk about the power. Cause I don't want to give that misinformation, but ultra durable. I can't state that enough. And this is nice. I like the gray color. It doesn't look too, uh, to, it's very inconspicuous. It's very low profile. When we put it on the desk, we can uh, we can do this. We can do this. Uh, yeah. Um, here, we put it on the desk. Very low profile, and uh, I like this. I love this. I can't wait to start using it. And now that it's finally out of the box, I'm gonna plug it in and uh, start using it tomorrow. I'm gonna see what I can do with it and what I can't. Okay, I've said enough of the same thing over and over again. <clears throat> Pardon me. The River, the EcoFlow River 2 portable battery is available today with three buying options from $299, okay? Um, this has almost a five-star review with over a 1,000 reviews. I think it takes one hour to fully charge via 110 volt. Yo, you can charge this whole thing in an hour and then get your laptops and stuff charged over a few times. This is good for lights. I mean, it's it's electricity with a grounded plug, so it's portable power. That's all you gotta say. You can do whatever you want with this. We could probably we could probably plug the 450 watt Ninja Blender into this and make a couple smoothies if we wanted to camping in the morning. And then just have the solar power charge it. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Okay. Enough of this. This is amazing. I can't wait to keep talking to you about it. It is available uh, with buying options starting at $299. Boom. One-handed. Look, I, I don't I don't lift weights. I don't do workouts. I got bad arms, weak arms because I don't work out. This is easy. This is easy. I mean, I'm I'm hurting right now, but you know what I'm saying? That it's it's pretty light. It's pretty light. Okay, let's put it back on the table. <laughs> awesome. And let's keep it moving. We talked about the e-meat. Oh, sweet. We're gonna get into some more new products that I never talked about before. It's going to be another day of let's just have some initial impressions. And then the next time we talk about them, we'll test them. Okay. So I'm real excited to just give a little bit, a little bit. Okay. Let's move on though to the next product. And this is going to be a four and a half star rated Bluetooth shower speaker by Tri Tribit. Tribit. I say Tribit because if it was Tribit, then it would be two Bs. That's what I think. So I'm going to keep saying Tribit, okay? And let's talk about the Tribit portable speaker. This has almost 5,000 reviews and four and a half star rating. This is 50 bucks today with a 17% off deal. It is regular 60 bucks. Today, it's 50 bucks, y'all. Yo, okay, we're talking about the Stormbox Micro. And that's this bad boy right here. Yo, I opened this already. It came to me not wrapped in plastic. I'm not sure. I can't remember if I opened plastic on this or not. But yo, we open it up. We got a nice set of instructions, and then when we pop this boy out, uh, it comes wrapped in the bag, okay? So let's pull it out, and uh, nothing could be desired in the box, just a simple charging cable. Okay, is there anything we should read on the back of this? No. 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 Okay, cool. Okay, let's open it up. Look, this is what it is. It's a nice little burger. It looks like a... Uh, it looks like a... Um, like a Klondike bar. It looks like a, it looks like a Choco Taco. Not a Choco Taco, but what is the square ice cream sandwiches? What's the square ice cream sandwiches? Oh, whoa. What did I just do? Does this come off? No. That's interesting. And then what's this? What is this? Is it, oh, is it like a strap to put it on a pole? Wow. Cool. Okay, cool. Look at this. This is what it looks like. This is the Tribit. Let me look at the name again because we're just talking about it for the first time. This is the Tribit Stormbox Micro. This is what it looks like. It can sit on a nice flat surface. When I saw this rubber boy, look, it's got little rubber booties, okay, uh, to put it on the table. And then it's got this like rubber strap or something. And uh, when I try to pull it from one side, it is fixed. And then when we try to pull it from the other side, comes out mad easy and then it's gotta be 
it's pretty small, right? It's not for it's not for your wrists. Clearly not for your wrist. It's got to be for wrapping around a pole, right? Look at the way that the it's like designed like a hook, so that when you put it in, it's like going in on the side. And even even the hook on the inside has a little hook, so it's got to be for like putting on your shower. Something. It's got to be for the shower, right? It's got to be putting for around around a pole or a pipe, a pole, pipe, whatever. Maybe wrap around a stroller, perhaps. Yeah, that could be a good idea. Yeah, I never thought about kids. That's a great one. Um, I was thinking like uh, with, I'm pretty sure this is IP67 waterproof. Okay. This has Bluetooth 5.0, a long battery life, it says, superior sound, and it offers a stereo speaker. It's got, it can't say stereo and then only have one speaker. So it's got to have two speakers in it. So that's cool. It's got simple um, volume up, volume down, and then power on the front. No, it's going to be play stop, I guess. I guess the square is going to be your play stop button, I would assume, because when we look at what could be the front of the device, we have a Bluetooth pairing button as well as a power button. Let's turn it on. Okay. So I got it turned on and it just looks like it's maybe like looking to seek something to connect to. We're going to connect to this another time. The aesthetic of this is really nice. Uh, I like how the blacks match pretty well between this like soft kind of coated rubbery bottom and the fabric top. They are not too, they're, they're not discolored. You know what I mean? They match pretty well. This is, this is nice. It weighs pretty, pretty good. It's a good feel in the hand. Uh, I don't think it says weight on the box itself. Yeah. So this is the Tribit Storm Box Micro. Today it's available for 50 bucks and it has almost a five star review with almost 5,000 reviews. So that's certainly saying something. We're going to connect this to something dope and listen to some non copyright DMCA, whatever free music another time. Okay. Let's get into the next product here. Now, this is something that I've been pretty excited to talk to you guys about and uh because it's been here for a few days and i've been so wanting to open it but i've just been patiently waiting and now is the time oh this is the heaviest box of the day this is the heaviest box of the day this is the tribit storm box blast yo this i think is gonna give the some anchor products a run for their money okay let's open this box up this is the storm box blast it's pretty heavy let's see what the box says you get the charging cable the manual and the unit you can download the app well we don't have an app today but we're gonna get that taken care of wireless party speaker supporting bluetooth 5.3 30 hours of playback time extra bass Tribit tri app, Bluetooth 5.3, colossal sound, 90 watts of sound. The anchor products that we look at, like that I have physically in the house, 80 watts. Uh, Beat-driven LEDs. We're going to take a look at the inside the box. IPX7 waterproof, customizable EQ, and 30 hours of battery life. Yo, let's open this thing. It's hurting my arm, okay? Uh, Tribit portable speaker has a $10 coupon. No, I didn't see that. So we can go back real quick. The portable speaker is 50 bucks and you get a $10 coupon. So it's 40 bucks today. I think 40 bucks and 5,000 reviews is a pretty good deal. And it is on deal. Like I said, 17% off. Okay. Thank you for reminding me, Randy. Uh, I do appreciate that. I don't always look at the product pages for the coupon. So it's very helpful. Okay. Let's get back to the Tribit tri tri Stormbox Blast. Storm Blast. What is it? What is it? Storm Box. This is the Storm Box Blast by Tribit. Okay. Let's open up this box. I want to keep them like uh, in like nice shape so that we can keep showing them on the show. I just want to keep them nice. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to rip it open if I don't have to. It's 
packed well. I'll give you that much. I mean, I guess I could have just tore at it, but I'm really trying to not. This is giving me a little bit of an issue. But there we go. We got it popped out. Now we should be able to get the box open. Pretty easy. Thank you for choosing TriBit. Be assured that we always stand behind our brands. If you have any questions regarding our products, please feel free to contact us. Support at trivet.com. Uh, Tribit.com. Submit a support ticket on Tribit.com slash support. Okay, here we go. Ready? Here we go. This is it. Oh, man. This is out of control. Look, we got a box. This is it. This is the whole radio, y'all. This is what you got. Okay, let's uh, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, okay. We're going to drop this box for a sec. Boom. Here we go. Oh, it's in plastic. Okay, let's open it. Look at this. Oh, this thing is heavy. Oh, this is the back side. Look at the front side. Oh, this thing is heavy. This thing feels heavier than the EcoFlow battery. Holy. Okay, yo, initial impressions, super heavy. It feels like really premium. Let's get a let's get the um let's get the Motion Boom Plus over here real quick and just show them side by side for size comparison. Okay. Yeah. See what I'm saying? This is the Soundcore Motion Boom Plus. And this is the Tribit Storm Box Blast. Okay, let's put the big boy down and the little boy over here. Uh, let's move the camera down a little bit so that I don't have to hold this up all the time. This way. Uh, this is nice. Let's press the power button and see what happens. When I press the power button, I can feel the little button under the rubber. I definitely felt it. Uh, the lights come on. It's definitely blue trying to pair something. Where's my phone? Here's my phone. I always have troubles like trying to pair my phone to stuff. I don't know why. But let's see if we can pair it today because this seems worth it. Uh, I want to. I, well, I wanted to wait, but now that I got it out of the box, I just can't wait. <laughs> I got to pair it right now. Uh, let's go to my connections and go to my Bluetooth stuff. And then, are we seeking? Yeah. Should be at the bottom. The storm box blast. Yes. Oh, did we just pair it? Oh, we did. We did. Oh, we did. Okay, let's hit up this YouTube video real quick. Dude, I'm so excited. I'm getting hot. I got to drink some water about it. Okay, let's see how this goes. Yo, let's go to the back table and crank this. Why is that? See, my Wi-Fi is so crap. Like, I don't understand why it cuts out. I don't understand why the Wi-Fi cuts out like that. Let me turn the Wi-Fi off and just connect with cell data. It's always, I don't understand why my phone. Here we go. Sorry for crying about it. So it's pretty loud, I think. It's definitely given these Anchor Soundcore products a run for their money, I'll tell you that. Uh, normally, the Tribit Stormbox Blast is $259. This is almost $100 more than the Soundcore Motion Boom Plus. Today, today it's $200, which is only like $20 more than the Anchor Soundcore Motion Boom Plus. This thing sounds loud. Look at how cool the light show is on the side. You can completely toggle it. You can turn all the lights off if you want. 
this is going to have options in the back uh, to oh, it has options in the back. Uh, let's see. It's got auxiliary in USB C as well as like a traditional uh, like charging port. I don't know what the name of this port is called, but you can charge like with your standard kind of thing. And then you can put your grommet back in place and restore that IP67 waterproof. Oh, we're not a resident because we don't want any more any more music. Thank you. Okay, good. Yo, this is dope. This is heavy though. This is heavy, okay? I don't know how much it weighs, but this is really heavy. Did I win this? No, I had this sent to me for the show, okay? I had this sent to me for the show. Uh, so let's turn it off. Just press and hold. Power down. Uh, easy to go. Okay. The Tribit Stormbox Blast, again, is available today for $199.99. And it has a $40 coupon. It has a $40 coupon. So that makes it $160. And that's even cheaper than this. You can get this today for cheaper than this full price. So consider those options. This is heavy. I got I to gotta put it down. I got to stop holding it up. Uh, I don't know what the weight of it is, but it's got some weight to it. And then uh, I feel like these are, are passive speakers as well, passive drivers. I don't think they're powered, but it's heavy enough that it feels like it could be powered. Now, also, I think what makes this heavy is that it has that 30-hour playback, you know what I'm saying? And that you can charge out on it. I'm not sure what the size of the battery is. This is another brand new product that I'm happy to show you guys today, my initial impressions. And I'm going to learn more about the ins and outs of it, okay, and then bring it to you. But this feels nice. It feels like a, it feels like almost like a, like a higher quality plastic feel than the Motion Boom Plus. They feel, they feel pretty similar. They feel pretty similar, okay. I'm going to say they feel similar. You know what it is? The handle, I got to put this down again. The handle of the storm box is just a, just slightly more textured than, than that of the Motion Boom Plus. Yo, <laughs> Tribit Stormbox Blast, you know what I'm saying? Okay, let's put this back on the table. We're going to clean up our box, okay, and put it back on the table, and then we're going to keep the show going. I love the lights. Yeah, well, well I'll, I'll show you again. I'll show you again. We'll just take a look at it without the light on real quick, but uh, they just look like um, they just look like a like a like a up and down. Like you know how they Gobi has those TV lights that move up and down. I think that's just this, and I think it just goes up and down with the music. But we're gonna learn more about the light show and bring a lot more details about the Tribit Stormbox Blast in shows to come. Okay. That's good. Oh, those are just some inserts. We'll pick those up after. Okay. Wish I could get my Motion Boom Plus. I hope that you get it soon. Okay. Let's move on to the Rosetta Star Projector. You know, I haven't been paying super close attention, I feel, to the chat tonight. What's up, G Zone? I hope that you're doing well. I see you greeting me four minutes ago. I hope you're still out here watching. Uh, appreciate you coming out today. Okay. Um, do do do. The lights is good. Oh, has got good sound. Yeah, G Zone has great sound. It has really good sound. Uh, I'm gonna put them both side by side and give them my own little. Nothing can be better than your ears. You know what you like. You know what I'm saying. And I think that opinions vary on audio preference, and that's why there's so many different options. Okay. Uh, let's go back to this shot here. And uh, yeah, so I think. Uh, it, it's louder. It sounds louder, but I want to do some bass tests and see some other stuff about it. Okay, let's keep it moving and talk about the Rosetta Star Projector now. I got that in this box right here. Now, we did a big demo with the Tribit, so we're going to forego the light demo today, but this is it. This is the Music Aurora Projector Lamp. This is the box. This is the Rosetta Star Projector, and uh, when we open this, when we open this, we get instruction manual and some packing plastic. We get an IR blaster remote. And then this is the product. This is all else that you get in the box. Now, it is USB-C powered. Uh, I got so many products that I've opened. Forgive me. I don't know if this comes with the USB-C cable or not in the box. But um, uh, does it have a parts list? I'll tell you if it should have one or not. 
it should. It should. It should have a USB-C cable included with it. And then uh, that plugs in where it plugs in. There's a few buttons on this to control music as well as the different light aspects. And the different light aspects are the Aurora projection lamp in the top as well as a green laser star like laser that makes it look like stars. So that's really cool. This is cool because it puts like a waving light across your ceiling that looks like Aurora Borealis, the night star, the night uh, lights. Um, uh, what are the what are the Aurora Borealis called? Night. What? Uh, I just know Aurora Borealis. I don't know night. It's not night lights. What is the other? What's the other name for Aurora Borealis? It's not night lights. Anyway, let me know if you remember. But yeah, this this projects an Aurora like. Uh, projection light on your ceiling it's really fun you can control the different colors with this uh there's red green blue and white and you can toggle all those colors you can have those colors uh all blend together if you want northern lights the northern lights thank you rover that's what i wanted to say uh yeah the this projects like the northern lights now when we think about the northern lights the northern lights are very green and orange and yellow this projects like reds and blues, uh, the green and the white. And like I was saying a moment ago, you can toggle those colors. You can have just one color. You can have a Mac, uh, uh, a mix of the colors that you want. Uh, it can cycle through the colors. It offers three different speeds of the Aurora uh, going by. Uh, also, it has a Bluetooth speaker into it. So you can pair to it and play some audio through it. Maybe you need some calm, soothing sounds that you want to uh, have in conjunction with this you can do that also it has some sounds built into it as well and let's see let's take a look at the box night lamp relaxation home party ambient lamp with eight white noise bluetooth connection a combination of colors i said all this i said all this Yeah, it doesn't say app. Eight natural sounds, starry lamp, Bluetooth connection, remote control. What is the Bluetooth connection? Oh, the Bluetooth for the audio. I'm an idiot. I was thinking of apps. Uh, the, the included remote control. It says this has voice control mode. So I don't know if that's just like microphone. Here's your microphone and then and then strobes the lights. And then also it offers some timer functions. So this is it. This is a really popular seller. Low battery. Why? Why do we have low battery? It should be plugged in not plugged in. Yo, please excuse me again real quick. I just got to plug this thing in. Oh, here's the cable flopped out on the floor, not plugged in at all. Okay. There we go. My mistake. My mistake. We're back in action. We are charging. Okay. This is ultra popular. This has over 11,000 reviews, four and a half star rating. Today it's on deal. It's 33% off making it 39.99. So that's 40 bucks on a product that is normally 60 bucks. Save $20 today. Star projector galaxy, uh, the star projector Rosetta galaxy projector also has a 10% coupon off. So 40 bucks and 10% is four bucks. So like what, 36 bucks today, $36 for the Rosetta projector. It's really light. It's just got some bulbs in it that, uh, and then like a mirror that, or like a reflector that you can see how it's kind of like a waving pattern, sort of, you can see it. That's the waving pattern that's on the ceiling. It's awesome. It's really fun. Okay. So if you don't have one of these, these are definitely worth checking out. I know they make a couple different versions of these. They make some that look like dinosaur eggs that are physically aesthetically like materialistically pleasing you know what i'm saying like aesthetically but uh they offer similar lights this is the same thing maybe like a different looking setting but essentially the same concept of light you know projecting leds through uh like a mirror or whatever okay yo what is this box this is the box for the tribe what's in here oh it's the power cable cool well i figured as much i didn't know what to expect Okay, we'll leave these products here. Let's put the lamp back on the desk today. This is $40 with a 10% coupon. Uh, hey, I'm glad that you got your phone plugged in, G-Zone. Don't let it die. We're talking Amazon products, baby. It's the time. Now is the time. Okay, sat of six piece. We talked about that. Okay, let's move on to the Svant smart light bulbs. And I assume the strip lights are going to be uh, right behind. Yo, we got the standing desk. Now I'm thinking about taking my strip lights. I'm thinking about taking my LED strip lights now and finally using them. 
I'm finally going to open these up. Now, this desk is about 12 feet all the way around. I did a quick measure, but this is 16 and a half feet of LED strip lights. Uh, today, they have four and a half star rating with almost a thousand reviews, okay? Uh, these are $19.99 for this little strip. When you get this strip, you're going to get the box. And when we open it, uh, Vaunt lets you know that it's time to, uh, you need chaos in your soul to give birth to a dancing star. Okay. So, and then look, there's more. We pull it out. We pull it out. We've got our roll of lights. We've got a little 16 foot roll of lights. And uh, these are spaced about an inch or two apart. I'd say these are spaced about an inch apart. And so there's probably going to be 30 LEDs per meter on this roll. This is 16 and a half feet. You're going to get a little controller, which is going to be pretty cool for me when I put it like right on the desk. That's going to be neat. Uh, and the controller has a simple pigtail for your uh, lights, okay, as well as one for your AC adapter. And you get your adapter built in uh, a scent in the box as well and then also they offer you some mounting hardware that comes like in a little ramen spice pack which is really fun that's basically it you know i never unrolled these and i haven't tried them yet but since i have these in my hands and i don't have any other the only other led strip lights i have that are in boxes are the hundred foot the hundred foot of keep smile lights so I think it's time to maybe put some LED lights under the desk for fun. I never really did that. I never really put LEDs on my desk. I thought it was like, whatever. But no, these look like they might be fun. Now, these are also, I believe, going to be app controlled through the Vaunt app. I've downloaded the Vaunt app on my phone so that I could mess with the Vaunt smart bulbs. We're going to talk about those basically right now. Let me get this repacked. And uh, yeah, so real quick again. These bulbs are $19.99 for 16 and a half feet. They do have the app. I use the app with, uh, with the smart bulbs. So it's the same app. So they interact the same way. They got change the color, uh, you know, microphone mode. It connects to your phone with Bluetooth. So really fun LED strip lights, I think, based on my experience with the smart bulbs. But yeah, I think this box is about to be pulled out of stock. And I'm going to use it finally. I'm going to put it under the new desk here. Okay. So these light strips, like I said a moment ago, are 20 bucks today. Okay. Now let's go back in the carousel and see the Smart Light Bulbs 2-pack. That's this bad boy right here. These Vaunt Smart Light Bulb 2-pack. I'm always standing in front of these bulbs. The bulbs that I'm going to show you in this box right now, okay, are the exact same style of bulb that I have in my studio lights. And so I don't know what I was expecting. I don't know what I was expecting. I thought that the lights would be. Oh, it's windy outside. I hear the tarp blowing on the scooter. It's going to blow away. Hopefully it doesn't blow away. Um, look, plastic bulbs. Okay. Uh, these are cool, but they do. The app makes these bulbs have their setbacks. The bulbs themselves are very cool. Like I said, they're plastic. They're RGB. Today, you can get this two-pack for $17.99. It's got a four-star rating with uh, basically 5,000 reviews. And uh, yeah, I would probably give it like a four-star rating as well. Here, I love to talk about what I don't like about this light because literally everything else about the light is extremely dope. Uh, so I just want to point this out. When I download the Vaunt app, I got this two-bulb pack. I thought that I could sync the bulbs together, but that's not the case. When I download the app, I got to sync, pair one bulb, and then pair the other bulb. Oh, okay, no problem. But can I sync the color coordination with the bulbs? No, no. I can set solid colors, but there are like little themes or scenes, you could say, like preset patterns that are built into the Vaunt app. And uh, uh, these are the Vaunt bulbs. Yeah, the, into the Vaunt app. And, um, and yeah, I just can't get the two bulbs to blink the same thing at the same time. If I select the same, I can't sync them. I can't sync them. That's it. Other than that, these are really cool. They offer over 16 million color gradient and uh, easily, easily controllable with the app. They're fairly responsive. It takes about a second, I'd say, for the command to go to the light. Uh, yeah, and I put these up. They make pretty decent mood lighting. I bet if I had more of these, it would be even cooler. But because I have two and I don't have more, I bet a single bulb would be best suited in a lamp. You know what I'm saying? Whether you put a shade on it or not, I'm just saying like a single ambient light bulb in one spot and then another one in another. Only 
because I can't get them to sync. If I could get them to sync, I would put them both in the same receptacle, and that would be cool as well. Okay, the Vaunt Smart Light Bulb 2-pack, again, is available today. Oh, the LED strips have a 40% coupon. The LED, that's like, that makes them like, uh, what, 12 bucks or something? Yo, that's a good deal. That's a really good deal. Yo, Randy Dresden, thank you for being on top of the coupon stay. I appreciate you helping me with that information. Uh, I never look. I never look. So you're awesome today. Um, yeah, so the Vaunt LED light strips, let's re-highlight them and pick up the box. These are available for 20 bucks, okay, today, but they have 40% off. So that's going to be like 12 bucks, right? 12 or 13 bucks. 40% off. You can't go wrong. I mean, uh, 16 feet for 12 bucks. It's a, it's less than a dollar a foot. Okay. Let's jump back though to the smart light bulbs and just wrap this up. These are available in the two pack today for $17.99. And uh, yeah, that's it. Okay. Let's put these back in this box and let's keep it going. We got, I feel like uh, because we got to the Vaunt bulbs, we must be getting close to the master maison stuff. So we must only have like five or six products left. Okay, we talked about the smart light bulbs. We talked about the strips. Okay, let's talk about the 11 piece. We're going to bring both of these knives up. We'll talk about them back to back. Let me grab these boxes because we're going to talk about this next. Okay, and let me grab the other box. And just set that box gingerly, gingerly to the side. Pardon me. You know what I haven't done in a while? Drink water. Let's take a water drinking break. Did I do the whole hour without drinking water? Oh, I'm feeling quenched. Excuse me. <clears throat> feeling so quenched. <clears throat> Pardon me. Okay, let's talk now about this 11 piece Master uh, Supreme, the Master Maison Supreme Series kitchen knife set. This is the 11 piece block that we're going to get into right now. And this is the box that it comes in. Uh, let's set this box aside and let's quickly go over the knives. You get the block, that's one piece. What's cool about the block is it does offer the ability to resharpen your knives, even though these are the sharpest, sharp knives do get dull. Okay, we're only missing one knife from the thing today. Uh, it's in the uh, sink. Okay, so, oh, and I always forget the sizes. Okay, so you get an eight inch chef knife. And what's nice about these knives is that they're solid body knives and they have the uh, handle riveted onto them, okay? So uh, you get an eight inch chef's knife. We're gonna go over this super fast. You're gonna get an eight inch carving knife. Okay. And then also we get the eight inch serrated bread knife. Okay. That's what we got here. And then we also have the five inch utility knife. Okay. And then unable to make it for picture day today is the three and a half inch pairing knife. That's what this looks like. And then also we have four non serrated steak knives included in this kit and that's what you get with this kit these are really sharp these are machine sharpened out of the shop we've taken a look at these i mean they're made on a mass productive scale like of course they're going to be machine sharpened why would you get hand sharpened steak knives it doesn't even make sense i'm just talking out of my mouth okay so this is the 11 piece block today it is available for 57 dollars 99 that is 16% off. It's regular 68.84 down to 58 bucks today. This has four and a half star rating with over 11,000 reviews. So another great product. Click through the carousel and learn more about Master Maison products today. We're going to get into another one right now, a really cool one. We're going to talk about it. Let's put this on the table. Okay. Let's talk about now the next knife. We're going to talk about the Master Maison Authentic Japanese Damascus, uh, Japanese Steel Damascus Knife. This is that, and I love reading this one, okay? I love reading this one to you. It says, this knife embodies the uncompromising craftsmanship and durability Master Maison is known for. Imported AUS-10 Japanese Steel, premium grade steel. That's a cut above the rest combined with our unique grinding process, results in a razor-sharp blade that's easy to maintain, a joy to use, and manufactured to last for the rest of your life. Fit for a chef, yet made for the everyday cook, okay? 
I like that a lot. I like seeing that. Let's put this down like this. Okay, this is the knife that you get in the box. It is in a hinged box that is sealed shut with magnets. When we open this, we get a nice, let's just, let's hold this a little better. When we open this, we get a nice cleaning cloth that is having a little uh, flower uh, embroidered on it. And then we get the knife itself. I'm just going to hold it in here with my fingers. Uh, this is the knife. This is the olive wood handle. It comes in this nice felt and foam box. And when we pull the knife out, okay, I just want to show you that in the box, it also does include a sharpening stone. So maybe, maybe Master Maison machine sharpens their knives but when you talk about the japanese damascus knife that i've just unsheathed uh we're talking you can really really hone that edge uh at home with that included sharpening stone now how can we really make this look really good it there we go just get really close with it look at all that damascus that's really, really nice. And this is a really sharp knife. This just like glides through tomatoes. It's easy to go through those watery vegetables as well as things that are a little bit tougher. We used the, a really great demo of this uh, a little while ago when we had Mima on the show and uh, she was making pico de gallo. This is easy. Our other knives, our other knives squish tomatoes. Our other knives squish tomatoes. This cuts the tomato before it even touches it. Okay, uses a laser. The knife edge is a laser beam. Okay, no, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I don't want to give you the wrong information, but uh, it's so sharp that it feels like you're cutting your food with a laser beam. And that's just what you get with Master Maison. Okay, so you can put this back in like this plastic or Teflon uh, coated uh, sheath so that you can protect the box that it comes in. So I love that Master Maison really. Okay, how do we open this? There we go. I love that Master Maison really gives you like the ability to uh, protect this knife very well. And rightfully so, okay? Because today the authentic Japanese Damascus knife is available on deal. It's 25% off. It's regular $135. Today it's $101. $100, 99 cents. Uh, it has a four and a half star review with 229 reviews. Uh, I love the olive wood handle. Let me open the knife one more time and show you one more time. I love the olive wood handle on this knife. And what I really love about what I'm learning about what I love about these Damascus steel products from Master Chef is these really, really uh, intricate. They're not really intricate, but they're very elaborate um, uh, rivets. Okay. Now I know that we're not focusing on it, but we did look at it under a microscope once and we'll do that again another day. Uh, but really, really uh, detailed craftsmanship with these knives you're going to get. Okay. Let's put our cleaning cloth back into our box and let's see. What's up, Patusan? Just sorry I didn't say hello six minutes ago. I've kind of been not paying the closest attention, attention tonight to the chat but also i feel like the chat's been moving a little bit slow i see you 10 minutes ago Alyssa. thank you for joining uh the show thank you for joining the show and hanging out with us we're just talking about some regular old products some great products here on the show and uh we're almost done talking about physicals because we are done with the knives two vonks two knives the barbecue the yaki and the scale so i think we only got like four left right one two three oh oh yeah we got the uh, one two Three, four. So we got four left. Let's talk about the barbecue. Barbecue's mad easy object, to, a product to get through as well. Let's move these boxes here. Let me grab this bad boy. <clears throat> okay, this is a box that we don't open on the show because, uh, you know, with all due respect, we all know what a barbecue looks like. And this is what this barbecue looks like. It's pictured right on the outside of the box. We keep it in the box because we haven't used it yet. And it's winter time, so we don't need to open this. But when the spring comes around, we're going to build it. When we take it out of the box, it's bigger than the box. So for space saving, you know, that's all I'm saying. So this is the Weber Smoky Joe 14-inch grill. This is a nice grill. You can put like four or five burgers on this. This is a charcoal grill. And you can maybe put like four or five burgers on this and a couple sausages at the same time. This is great for tailgating. It's great for small meals uh, at home. I want to take this. Uh, it's perfect size for camping, I believe, uh, depending on how you camp. And, uh, yeah, it's just uh, offering on the box a 10-year limited warranty. And they also advertise that the grill – won't rust because it has a porcelain coating when you take care of the grill, right? So that's also super cool. And uh, yeah, there is assembly required. You do have to attach the legs as well as the handle. And uh, I know a couple of people now, My one of my personal friends, 
says that they have this grill. They use it for camping. It's more than adequate. It's, an, it's, it's a great grill. And somebody in the chat, somebody in the chat also, um, somebody in the chat uh, a while ago also said that they had one of these and uh, that they were very satisfied with it as well. So on deal today, 9% off. This is regular $62.39. Today, you can get the Weber Smoky Joe for $57. This has over 1,500 reviews and uh, pushing like four and a half stars. So definitely click through the carousel, okay, and learn more about Weber barbecues. If this is too small, uh, then there's certainly options that will satisfy your barbecue itch, okay? Okay, this is the Weber Smoky Joe, and it's 57 bucks. <clears throat> okay, what do we got next? Fine dine? Oh, yeah. Okay, so let's get into this real quick. This is another super fast one. We're going to talk about these fine dine superior, what do they say? Fine dine glass food storage containers. This comes in a three pack. This is what we're going to take a look at today. These are three 35 ounce thermal shock resistant bowls that have plastic lids, but glass bowls. They're glass bowls with plastic lids. Now, the plastic lids, they're hinged. So you just pull the hinges back really easy and lift the lid off. Excuse me. Now, this is watertight. We're going to forego the watertight demo today. It's always a success. Uh, now, what makes this watertight is that this glass has a flat lip. Now, I know it's maybe, there you go. There there we go. You can kind of see how it's a little bit lipped there. And what's great about that large lip is that the gasket that is in the plastic lid just squishes down nice against it and gives you that airtight lock, okay? This is going to help keep your food fresher up to twice as long. And it's really, really easy to just pull your fingers in here and pull the gasket out, Okay. Uh, so you can clean the gasket if you need to. You can clean if there's any particles or anything that get back here. But they advertise that the particles don't get back here. Our particles aren't supposed to be getting back here. But I'm sure that's just like with regular cleaning. Now, also, Fine Dine does say that all of this is dishwasher safe. So uh, we do personally wash our plastics not in the dishwasher. But I believe it. I believe it because not only are the, these glass, excuse me, <clears throat> these glass bowls are thermal shock resistant. So you can put these in the freezer and then take them out and put your food immediately in the oven. You can go from freezer to oven to table in one container. That's awesome. When we got these, we eliminated a bunch of plastic because it was nice to have the th the shot the thermal shock resistant glass. Okay, let me read the box about the things that I never memorized. Uh, really simple. Okay, the fine dine glass food storage containers are 100% leak proof. There's no trapped food. They're lead free. They're made of lead free glass and a BPA free lid. Uh, they help keep your food fresh up to twice as long. They're 100% hyper hypoallergenic and 100% uh, uh, bacteria, mildew, and mold resistant, as well as, like I just said, suitable for from oven to table use. So these are really great. We put leftovers. I got leftover. I can only show you one today because we got food in the fridge right now. I got chicken and leftovers from last night in one. I got some sliced up pineapple in the other one. What's up? What's up? Got a problem with my leftovers? I'm just joking. Okay, so that is the fine dine containers. Today, you can get these three 35-ounce containers for $22.99 and close to 10,000 reviews. 8,600 reviews, four and a half stars. Hey, what's up, Margaret? Uh, thanks for popping in and doing today's roll call. Okay, what's up, Cody? Who else popped in for the roll call who hasn't been talking today? Let's say... Let's see. Let us see. Ian B, Wiley S, Randy Dresden. You've been out here. Robin Luker, Bart, Denise, as well as Patusanja, Woolrich, Jennifer Lude, Alyssa, Ed S, Brenda, Travel Diva, Seabass, Margaret, and Hefe. And Cody, what's up, everybody? Thanks for doing the roll call today. Uh, as you know, these exist, and you can buy them, and it's for the order of $22.99. Now, if these sizes aren't what you're looking for, you know, click through the carousel, check out the Fine Dine store. There's definitely a lot to learn there, okay? Uh, and by learn there, I mean see what other uh, products exist to fit your kitchen requirements, 
what are we talking about next? Why scale? I grabbed the Yaki, so we're going to talk about Yaki first. Okay, this is the Yaki laser hair removal tool. It's designed to permanently remove hair from unwanted areas of your body. Now, this comes with an instruction book, and it comes with the device itself. Also, in the box, you're going to get uh, a little box that has some safety goggles because this is a laser, and it comes with the AC power adapter and a razor blade. So everything that you need to get started, permanently removing hair, from unwanted areas on your body. Now, what's cool about the laser is that it takes, a, I'm not gonna read the manual today, I'm gonna try to remember it, okay? It, the laser stimulates melanin in the hair follicle and that is absorbed as heat, which stops the follicle from producing the hair and extended treatments can permanently reduce hair from unwanted body parts like your arms or your chin, say, for example. Um, so yeah, always wear the safety glasses when you're using this and be mindful of the following. If you have a lot of melanin already in your skin, if you have a darker skin tone, then uh, the Yaki laser hair removal tool might not be the right product for you. Also, if you have red hair or blonde hair, uh, that might not be the right device for you as well. You can learn more about that by clicking through the carousel today and and, and seeing what Yaki has to say about it. There's a whole guide about what types of skin tones and hair colors don't work. And uh, Mima, Mima keeps saying that she wants to use it and then she doesn't. And then I'm like, well, let's make a video about it. And then we don't. So kind of like we're sort of enabling each other. I don't even know what for. Uh, she hasn't started using it, but maybe I can convince her on Saturday uh, to start when it's the weekend and it's not Thursday or Friday night at night and she's just getting home from work. So maybe we'll finally start soon. I don't have any hair on my body that I need to remove with the Yaki laser hair removal tool. So I can't speak from experience. So hopefully uh, Mima's got a little patch on her chin. I know she's very interested in, in trying this out. She just needs to get that motivation and do it. Okay, let's talk about, oh, also the Yaki laser hair removal tool is on deal today. It's 21% off. Its regular price is $150 and it's on sale today for $119. And this has a four-star review with over 1,200 reviews. Okay, everybody is doing the wonderful roll call, the wonderful roll call. Yaki laser hair removal tool also has a $30 off coupon. So that makes it like uh, $89, $89 today. So sub $100 on the Yaki laser hair removal tool. It's 21% off making it $119 and it has a $30 off coupon as well. Thank you for telling me that Randy Dresden. That is really helpful. That's really, really helpful. Um, okay, so that's it. Let's move on to the last physical product I got here in my carousel today. And that's going to be this. It's going to be the Wise Smart Scale. I got the box right here. Now, when you get the scale, it does come with batteries. And this is just a Bluetooth operated smart scale that you can use to weigh your body. I've got it right here. I did give it a little bit of a wipe down today. So hopefully it's very, very mirror finish. Like you can see the entire kitchen and fridge and door and everything. You can see the studio lights and uh, where's the camera? There's the camera, right? So, uh, yeah, so nice mirror finish, glass top, IPO coated glass. I don't know what that means, but it says it on the box. Uh, you can just use this as a scale and stand on it. It's going to tell you how much you weigh, but you can connect to the app with it. And then it starts tracking your weight, tracks your heart monitor, gives you a BMI reading and a few other metrics that you can use uh, when you download the WISE app for free, okay? So uh, this is pretty cool. Not only can I, I can stand on it and be, I am currently, I can stand on this and be 265 pounds. And then when Mima might step on it, if she has the app, then it will tell, it will be like, oh, this must be Mima because it's relative weight, right? Relative weight. So that's a really cool feature. And yeah, you don't need the app to use this, but it certainly helps track uh, some health metrics that you might otherwise not, not may not be tracking. This is a really affordable scale, okay? It's $36 today. It has a four and a half star rating with over 23,000 reviews. So yeah, I got one. I stand on it. It tells me my weight. It tells me my heart rate. tells me my BMI. And it tracks it all for me in the app. And it's got a wavy line for the app. Hey, what's up, Lori B? Welcome to the show. 
Uh, okay, so that's the Wise Scale. We're done our physical products today. Like I said, the Wise Smart Scale is available for thirty-five dollars and ninety-eight cents. Okay, that's it, bro. We're done. One, two, three, four, five. We only have five products left. Okay, we could do that. Let's highlight the EcoFlow Delta Two. And uh, we, you know what? We only got five products left. Let's see what it's like standing at the standing desk today. And uh, let's see what that's like. Let's see if we can accomplish. We can go up a little bit now for me. I don't care if I'm showing the desk now. That's not too bad. Dude, the desk goes up at the press of a button. Isn't that so sick? Um, yeah, we can go up even a little bit higher if we want to. We go, uh, okay, well, we'll put the monitor down just a bit. It's a bit much. Okay, calm down. Yeah, we'll go there. That looks great. Okay, I love – doesn't that great? Dude, the desk moves. It's got the presets. Oh, man, I love it. Okay, let's get it ready to talk about our product pages. We've got our next product highlighted in our carousel here, and we're going to get into it. Uh, this is going to be another great EcoFlow product uh, that is reviewed by Dragon Blogger Nate. So let me share my screen and get all that set up. It takes just a second. Just a second. Now, hopefully we won't have bad full screen video issues like we did yesterday. But if we do, we'll get it sorted out. We always do. And with that, we hit hide and then we go like this. Uh, oh, and then let's do this. Yo, let's put the link in the chat today. Let me grab this link and then let me open up another web page so that I can grab our show. And then let me put that link in today's chat. Let me pause this video. We don't need all that playing. Okay, let's put this in the chat. Okay, so this is a link to the video that we're about to watch. And if you have the ability to click through and like the video like I just did down here by my face, where we point, right here where I'm pointing, uh, if you can go and like the video, obviously that's a great help to us. <clears throat> so if you can, please do. And with that, let's check out this video uh, about the EcoFlow Delta II Portable Power Station by Dragon Blogger Nate. Dragon Blogger Nate here. Today, I'm going to be giving you guys a quick rundown on the EcoFlow Delta II. This is the newest lineup in the Delta line from EcoFlow. As always, EcoFlow brought their A game with Little Big Brother Delta 2. You guys can see that right here, taking a look at the back, it's going to seem very familiar to the original Delta with your two AC ports, but you're going to have four ungrounded AC ports. Staying with what works, you're going to have your standard plugins for power that also gives you the option to charge over solar or your car. Now, if you want to extend this to 2,048 watt hours, you can do that with this extra battery port here on the side so you can add even more power to the already powerful Delta 2s capacity. You're going to have your two USB-A ports, your two USB 3.0A ports, and this time you're going to have two USB-C 100 watt outputs, which is crazy because everything's being powered by USB-C, so big shout out to them. Now, just like always, the display is going to look very familiar. Whenever you plug in something, it's going to reflect and register how much life you have remaining with the battery capacity based on what it is that you're charging. The Delta II is small but mighty. It has a ton of capacity at 1,024 watt hours. So you can take this with you on the go, road trips, camping, and keep all of your devices charged. So it really doesn't matter where you're at. If you're camping on road trips, the Delta II is going to keep you covered with a ton of battery life and very easy to use functions. So I'm Nate with Dragon Blogger. I hope you guys found this helpful. As always, thanks for stopping by and I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you, Dragon Blogger Nate, for talking to us about the EcoFlow Delta II Power Station. And thank you to the people that liked the video. We went from three likes to seven likes. Thank you so much. Okay, let's move on now. The EcoFlow Power Delta II is available today for $1,000, $999. Okay, now let's move on in our carousel and take a look at this Yosuda Magnetic Rower. Uh, this is the rowing machine. This is the indoor rowing machine. And this is going to be presented to us by Dragon Blogger Justin. Let me grab the link for this and also put it in the chat. And uh, well, hey, what's up, Richard Epsi? Thanks for joining. Yo, we're getting close to the end of this episode of Clown Live. So thank you for following. Make sure you head over to shoppingdragons.com slash win and enter for our $5 Amazon gift card, okay? And then come back here and hang out with us for the game. Yo, the EcoFlow Delta II Portable Power Station has a $50 off coupon. So it's uh, $949 today. Thank you, Randy Dresden. 
Uh, okay, so yeah, Richard, get entered for the $5 Amazon gift card. Do the roll call. Go ahead in the chat and say whatever it is. Uh, coffee is ambrosia. I don't know if I agree with that. The coffee gives me heartburn. But um, but yeah, that's it right there. Rover's got you in the chat, Richard. If you're still here, thank you for watching. I hope that you have good luck on your side if you enter our gift card giveaway today. Now, without further ado, let me grab this link and uh, I'm going to paste it in the chat here. So if y'all have the ability, you know, to help us out, if you have already, thank you. And if you have not, please consider going through and liking that video link. Okay, this is the video that we're going to play right now. I've got it uh, queued up. Uh, we start the video out with eight likes. Let's see how many more likes we this can get on the video in the next two and a half minutes. An absolutely. I think I got to full screen the video first and then play it. I have a problem when I transition from... I have a problem when I oh, went up to 11 already. Wow, you guys are awesome. Okay, uh, I think I have a problem when I... This Yasuda indoor rowing machine. Is. I think I have a problem when, I full, when I'm playing and then I full screen. I think if I play after I full screen... Dude, Amazon videos throw me for a loop. They throw me for a loop. And I haven't really been having this issue with the show, have I, in a while? So I don't understand. Let, let's make me a little bit bigger here. And uh, let's see what we can do here about this Yosuda indoor rowing machine. This Yosuda indoor rowing machine is an absolutely fantastic. Why? 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 I know that it might be echoing through the laptop speaker. Look, why can't, it, why can't the video play the video? You know what I'm saying? It, it, it makes me feel frustrated because I just want to do a good show. I just want to do a good show. And when these things that seem to be beyond my control occur, internally, internally, I'm screaming right now. I'm screaming internally right now because it's 2023 and we should just be able to play a video on the internet. You know what I'm saying? So let's try again. This Yasuda indoor rowing machine is an absolutely fantastic workout and fitness product that once you put it together with only 10 screws and about 20 minutes of time, you could fold it up just like this. All you have to do is unscrew the locking mechanism and the pin. So you just screw this in at the bottom here and then it stays folded up in a vertical position. Doesn't take long if you want to put it away for a day, make it take up less floor space. It's easy to do. Just simply screw it in, lock it up, and then take it out the next day. Or maybe you only row on weekends. You just lock it up and slide it in the corner. What I really love is just how little space it takes up when it's folded up. You could just put it right away in a corner in a living room or an office or a bedroom with a lot of extra space. And it takes up almost no room at all. Among the most folding, fold, it is among the most foldable rowing machines I've ever seen. Now, the magnetic resistance on the rowing machine here gives you a lot of different resistance levels, and it works out about 90% of your muscle groups. I really love rowing machines because they're great for your core back muscles, your shoulders, your arms, and your legs. They have slip-resistant foot pads, and it just is so quiet. This fact, this rowing machine is so quiet that my son was actually rowing while we were watching Stranger Things Season 4 last night, and it doesn't make hardly any noise at all. It tracks your time, tracks your distance, tracks how many rows, and you can see the stand on the top of it is big enough to hold a big tablet or a phone with ease. So now it's not a smart machine. It doesn't have any AI. It just does uh, analog digital tracking, and you put batteries into the display, but the slide is smooth on the seats. It provides incredible magnetic resistance, and you could just turn the knob to adjust resistance levels. And I use the rowing machine at the gym all the time, and this is as good as any professional rowing machine I've ever used. If you're looking for a rowing machine that will help you burn those calories, work out your muscles, and just give you a good upper and lower body workout combined, this Yusuda indoor magnetic rowing machine is just fantastic. My son had never used a rowing machine before, and he was super impressed at just how well it worked out his shoulder muscles, his back muscles, and his pecs. Now, he's a huge fan of it, uses it twice a day, even while watching TV. Again, it's extremely quiet, and of course, the dogs get excited while he uses it, but I've made a total rowing machine fan out of him. This rowing machine could support up to 350 pounds, somebody who's up to six foot six in height. It has plenty of room to go back and forth. Again, anti-skip pedals, folds up when it's not in use. This is a fantastic rowing machine and it is highly recommended if you want to work out at home 
Thank you so much, Justin, for showing us the Yosuda Magnetic uh, Rowing Machine. That is available today on deal. It's 32% off of its $410 MSRP, and it's available today for $279.99. So like I'm saying, it's going from $410 down to $280. <clears throat> not too bad. Not too bad. Okay, let's keep it moving here. Oh, oh okay, so it's $279. And it has a $50 coupon today. So 80 and 50, what's that? 230 then? 230.99 or 229.99. Can't do simple math. I can't do it. I think I'm pretty close there. But a $50 off coupon on its $280 MSRP today. I think that makes it 230. So 229.99. Click through the carousel to learn more. Okay, let's move on to the eMeet meeting capsule. I know this video. This is a video that has been made by Dragon Blogger Nate. Okay. So let's do what we do and let's copy that link and put it into our Amazon chat. Oh, hold on. Let's check the other one. I forget what we started at, but when we refresh the rowing machine, we got 12 likes. Awesome. Thank you so much. Okay. Let's start now with this one. Uh, okay. Here's the link. Paste. I just liked it. I'm going to like it before you guys. Okay. I'm like number five. Let's switch over to our show. And uh, yeah, we're going to watch these in the windowed mode today because I'm having some issues with playing the full screen video. I don't get it. Uh, I'm going to figure it out, I guess. Okay, so let's take a look now at what we need to know about the EME capsule 360 webcam with eight microphones. Hey, what is going on, guys? Nathaniel with Dragon Blogger Tech and Entertainment. And today we're going to be taking a look at this awesome meeting capsule from a company called EMI. Now, this thing is super awesome and has a ton of awesome features built into it. It has a Red Dot Design Award nomination and it won in 2021. It has a bunch of different modes built into it. But let's go ahead and jump in and see everything that this comes with. And then we will test this out inside of its software. So unboxing this, the first thing you're going to notice right here is we got an empty box right there. Pretty nice, stable packaging. And then opening this box, you're going to get a few of your accessories on the inside right here. So the first thing you're going to notice is you're going to get a user manual. I highly recommend using that because it has a ton of awesome and helpful information. And then you're going to get your extra long braided USB-C cable to plug this in and interface with your computer. And then you are going to get your hey, what's AC up, Stargazer? and remote. Now, I'm not going over the remote just because it's not going to really show everything that I show inside of the program. And then you're of course going to get the unit itself. It has this aluminum housing with the speaker that surrounds the entire body of the machine. It looks super cool. Taking a look on the backside right here, you can see that you have all of the controls. So you have mode selectors, lockout, you can mute your microphone. This is where you're able to plug it into your computer, plug it into external speakers and plug in power. And on the bottom, you're going to have this anti-movement rubber padding and you're going to get your quarter inch tripod adapter so you can hook this up to your tripod let's check it out the program all right guys so now we are here inside of the program as you guys hey, what's up ian thanks for coming out today we're just talking about this so emi capsule some of the features look, look at nate look how much you can see all four walls in this room it's actually pretty crazy it. i think so what you're going to notice right up here you're going to have a bunch of different options so you can release screen to make this a completely detached screen from the main program you're going to have different modes and options where you can turn off the camera. So as you guys can see here, when you turn off the camera, this is what it will appear to other people that are on the other end of your conference call. You can also mute the mic. We are not using the mic in this video. You have anti-flicker options here. You have zoom options. Right now we are in classic mode. So as you guys can see here, excuse my dirty room, but we have a pretty wide view. Um, we can switch to other modes right here. So we can go spotlight mode, which it will zoom in on one person that is speaking. Now, continuing on, this is in private mode. Now, all of these modes are controllable through the remote, so you don't have to use the software to do this. But as you can see here, the in private mode is basically just turning off the camera and the microphone for complete discretion with your conversations. Now we move to collaboration mode. So what this is going to do is basically allow the camera to focus in on multiple people at the same time. Now I am only one person speaking, but what I'll do is I'll go ahead and turn this. And so when I start speaking here, what you're going to notice is it's going to pull me into a frame. Now, if there was another person talking, it would automatically pull that in. And it's trying to actually pull in multiple people here because it's seeing my screen. So we'll go ahead and rotate this. And we will switch to the speech mode. So now what speech mode is going to do is it's going to center whoever is speaking, but one person at a time. 
So as you guys can see here, it focused me directly. But what we're going to do is go ahead and turn this around. And if I start speaking, microphone check, microphone check, mic check, one, two, one, two, it's going to focus on just me. And then once I stop speaking, say there's another person in the room, I will simulate that by just basically turning this, as you guys can see here, it focused on the person talking again. We're going to go ahead and switch back real quick to the classic mode. So we are now in the classic mode. And as I said before, there are a ton of options for each individual mode. You have white balance, brightness, contrast, image flip, angle, initial position. There's a ton of different things inside of this app. You can update the firmware. Um, there's so much that you can do with this software and this camera. So if you guys have been looking for a new camera for your conferences or your meetings or anything along those lines, I definitely recommend this one. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you, Nate, for talking to us about the eMeet Capsule 360 webcam with eight microphones. This has four and a half star review with 35 reviews. This is $800 today. I don't know if there's a coupon for it. Maybe Randy Dresden will tell me after I've moved on from the product, but it is available for $799.99. And now we got two products left. So I think y'all are closing that roll call probably right here. And now let's, oh, let's refresh the page and see how many likes we got. We went from five likes to Went from five likes to eight likes. Yo, thank you so much for the people that liked the video. Let's grab the link for the Aqua Crest inline water filter for refrigerators. And let's pop that bad boy in here. Bang. And then I'm going to go like it. I'm going to be like number 13. I'm like number 13. Uh, if y'all can click over on that, if y'all can highlight that link and like the video. Super helps us here on Shopping Dragons and Dragon Blogger. Let's watch the video, though, which I believe is by Nikita regarding this inline water refrigerator filter. So here's everything for my AquaCrest AQINL five-year inline water filter. I'm going to install this to my Samsung refrigerator so that I can just get that added bonus to the filtered water that comes through my system. So I'm going to install this and show you guys what it's like when it's set up and then enjoy the purified water. So after about, I want to say honestly, 10 to 15 minutes of work, I've basically got it set up. First, you have to turn off your um, refrigerator line um, to make sure that no water is running when you unplug it from the actual refrigerator. And then uh, once you get the little setting, um, that little a screw set up there and plugged into the filter you want to let the filter run for about five minutes which is honestly the part that takes the longest is just uh, making sure that you um, flush out the filter and then you set up this little piece right here um, and plug it into the actual line in your fridge and then um, then you take that white uh, cord and you put it into the other end of the filter which is marked out and they're marked in and out so you want to make sure that your refrigerator line goes um, is connected to the out, and you want to make sure that the water line is in to in. Let it flush for five minutes, plug it up, get the clip set up so that you can mount it to your fridge, and then you're basically good to go. Um, I have been enjoying it. It's I already ran like a small glass of water, tasted it, I can already taste the difference, and so I'm excited to use this. It's good for five years. So if you're in the market for a really nice filter that's compatible with most fridges. Definitely check this one out and get it set up. Thank you, Nikita. The uh, Aqua Crest inline water filter, five-year water filter. I don't know. It says five years on my product page, but it only says inline water filter here. Uh, but it is available today for $24, and that's four and a half star rating with over with almost 2,300 reviews. So if you if you got a fridge that serves water and you're looking to keep that water extra clean tasting, an Aqua Crest inline water filter for refrigerators may be the opportunity you are seeking. Yo, we took that video from 13 likes all the way up to 15 likes. So thank you to the two people that liked that. Appreciate y'all. And now I think we're going to move on to our final product here and that's going to be the Billitalk massage chair now i know it's nate that does this so let me do the thing that we are doing and let me get that link in the chat boom that's for the Billitalk chair i'm going to rush over there and be like number three okay let's check it out the day has finally arrived my friends this is the Billitok Full Body Zero G Massage Chair. This is the best product I think I have ever used, 
ever in the history of all existence ever. Let me show you why. Here's the first reason right here. At some point, everybody in their life has had sore feet. So not only is the Bilitok massage chair going to massage the bottom of your feet, it's also going to massage the inside and outside of your calves with air compression technology. Oh, do you have a sore butt? Did you fall on it? Well, don't worry about that because it's going to massage your butt as well. Oh, your back hurts? Well, guess what? It's going to massage your back as well. Wait, did I hear somebody say that their arms are sore? Guess what? It massages your forearms. Okay, that's cool, Nate, but does it massage your shoulders? Um, Actually, yes, it does. On the left and the right side, as you guys can see right over there, you're going to have compression technology that's going to compress your shoulders. And do you guys see that beautiful Billitok branding right there? Behind that, this is also going to massage your neck. Okay, Nate, but how does it do all this? easily with this controller right here you guys can see that this controller is super inclusive there's a ton of options on here so you can get this thing tuned and adjusted to your body and exactly where you want it to massage i feel the need to mention that this also has Nate's bluetooth hand speakers moving built into in it video, on either the, side of your head so you're able to listen to your favorite forward. podcast music it movies not michelle i don't D. care nature sounds uh, what do you listen to uh, you can do it with this Mor moratini right, what's up michelle moratini thanks for following you know, missed the opportunity to get in on that gift card today but oh, stick yeah. around and watch how we do it and then come back tomorrow okay nate but i really want to be able to lay down while i'm getting massage well zero g to the rescue baby All right. Okay, cool, Nate. So you can lay down, but what about vibe out? You definitely can vibe out. If you guys look right down there, you have these ambient lights that are on both sides of this to really set the mood. I really don't think there's much left to be said. You guys can see that this Billitok massage chair comes with so many features. This is going to be great for pretty much anyone that I can think of. So definitely check this out. I'm Nate with Dragon Blogger. See you guys on the next one. Peace. Did I miss? I guess I wasn't looking at the screen enough. I must have missed the clip where... Uh... <laughs> I must have missed the clip where he was laying in it and relaxing extremely. Yo, let's refresh this page. We went from three likes all the way up to six likes. Yo, thank you for the additional three likes on the video. I appreciate y'all supporting us with getting those likes on these videos that we share with y'all. That's awesome. Okay, let's switch it over to me. And then let's hit the Amazon chat and just be like, yo, I'm ready. I'm ready for the list. I'm ready for the list of names for today's. $5 Amazon gift card clown race. Okay, here we go. Blake, after race, type name in the chat. They will have 60 seconds to claim. If not, then go to second place. Um, yeah, we'll do one race today. We generally don't do one race, do we? We generally don't do one race. We do multiple races. We'll do one race today. Sounds like a great idea. Let's do that. Let's do that. So um, let's see. Oh, uh, okay. So you said it at the top and the bottom of the list. Thank you for getting my attention about it, Rover. I appreciate you. Okay. So I'm going to grab this list though. It starts with you, Rover, and it ends in with Stargazer's name. Let's head over to my show here and show you what I'm looking at. We're looking at this. We're looking at this. Let's hit our names list and edit that list paste this list okay everybody help because we've had some doubles okay we had randy dresden twice yesterday let's make sure we don't have any doubles today all right so let's go to the top of the list we got rover okay in first place we got robin luker jennifer lude cody lake bart evans randy dresden wiley s ed s cool shopper brenda haynes Alyssa. Okay. And then we scroll down here for some more names and we have Patu Sanja right here at the top. Ian B. Denise Marte. Seabass who left. Margaret. Hefe. Travel Diva 2. Chucky. Lori B. Samantha Guvaro. Arlene Leotard. Okay, Ian and Ian B. We have two Ians. And then Stargazer. Stargazer wraps it up. I don't think there's any... Uh, uh, Rover Robin, Jennifer Cody, Bart Evans, Randy Dresden, Wiley Ed, Cool Shopper Brenda, Alyssa Pat, uh, Ian Denise, C Bass, Margaret, Hefe, Travel Diva, Chucky Lori, Samantha Guevara, Arlene, Ian, and Stargazer. Yeah, there's no doubles here. I don't see no doubles here. See any doubles here? I don't see no doubles, okay? So let's hit done. And then let me check my thing here for the shuffles and the time. Three shuffles, 50 seconds. You got it. Let's clear this time. Let's do 50 seconds and set that. And then let's shuffle this. What did you say? Three times? Three shuffle? Oh, wait. Uh, let me scroll up again. Hey, uh, Eros 
Nascimento Munez. Thank you so much for following here at the end of today's episode of Clown Live. Appreciate you in a big way. Don't forget to get entered into tomorrow's $5 Amazon gift card giveaway by heading over to shoppingdragons.com slash win. And Rover, while we're running the race, can you put the list for all the giveaways, please? Uh, that would be helpful. And then uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, three shuffles, right? Confirming three shuffles. Yeah, okay. Let's go back to my view. Let's shuffle this three times. One, two, three. Great. And then let's turn this music way down. Let's turn it up just a little bit. Ten will be good. Okay, let's do it. Let's hit start. <clears throat> Pardon me. Let's hit start. And this is going to be for first place to win a $5 Amazon gift card. Let's go. Thank you, everybody, for coming out and joining today's episode of Clown Live. It is Thursday, so we are going to do one more tomorrow on Friday. And then uh, I think I'm going to take two days off because since the Christmas holidays and, and since the New Year started, uh, I did like at least one show every weekend. And I think Mima will enjoy just having like two days of like not internet live streams. So I'm going to honor that for her this weekend. So yeah, tomorrow's going to be our last show for the weekend. We're going to do it at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time tomorrow. And that's going to be great. And thank you everybody for doing that extra participation by liking our B-roll videos today. I'm going to keep that up because it's definitely helpful. Now with five seconds left, is it going to be Cool Shopper or is somebody going to take over? Is it going to be Evans? Yo, it's Cool Shopper. Congratulations, Cool Shopper. You just won a $5 Amazon gift card. Uh, let me uh, move my mouse over here and type your name and make sure that you're in the chat. I mean, I see you say yes, so I'm not going to type your name now. Congratulations, Cool Shopper. You did it. You did the roll call. You entered your email in the form. You hung out with us and got the big $5 W. Okay, let me see what we're looking at here. We'll do this. This, and this, yes. Let's full stop the show real quick here, and let's message Justin and let him know. Where is it? Here he is. That cool copper wins. January, it's already January twelfth, y'all. I can't believe that. In the twelfth, right? Uh, January twelfth. Five dollars. Cool copper wins. January twelfth. Five dollars. Boom. Send that message off to my man, Justin. Good to go. Good to go. Let's minimize Discord. And then let's pull over here and see who placed where as we end today's show. First, second, and third place right here. Cool Shopper. Congratulations again. Arlene Leotard and Evans in third. Uh, we got Cody Lake in seventh place today. Lori B in eighth. Ooh, Randy Dresden in 11th place today. Um, did I say it? Oh, hold on. Sorry, never mind. I'm an idiot. Uh, 12th place, E and B, Stargazer. 17th place, C Bass. Okay. Jennifer Lee, you came in 15th today. It would have been really cool if you came in 17th. And honestly, I hope that you hit 17th place tomorrow. That would just be flabbergasted, mind blown. Okay. If you do that, uh, when we do our extra $5 Amazon gift card giveaway tomorrow, uh, Travel Diva in 18th place today. Patu Sanja. I like that name. Patu. Patu Sanja. Patu Sanja, 19th place. Uh, Wiley S, Ian Rover, 24th place today, and Hefe in 25th, eh? Always a bridesmaid, never a bride over here, eh, Rover? Jeez, Louise. Thank you, though, for doing your moderator uh, um, role here. I really appreciate that. It definitely helps uh, make the races go by a lot faster. And, uh, yeah, that's it. Is the music still playing? Did I turn my music way down? Stop the clown music. I didn't realize it was still playing. Okay, let's make me big. Okay, here we are at the end of the show. Thank you, everybody, for joining me here on Clown Live. Uh, we're going to do another episode tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's 10 p.m. Zulu time if you're out there. And so, yeah, that's it. Uh, Patu Sanja, make sure to check All Key Shop. You won on Ship Roman's Wheel. Yo, congratulations, Patu Sanja. I need to go. Uh, I, I want to go win something. I want to go win something. Maybe I will tonight. Maybe I'll have luck tonight. Uh, that's it. So, Bar. Oh, yeah. Let's greet everybody goodbye. Let's say goodbye to everybody in the chat. Of course, I need to do that for sure. Uh, okay. Rover, Wiley, Denise, thank you all for coming out today. Uh, and joining the show. Go, go, go. 
Alyssa, thank you. Uh, Ready Master, thank you for joining our show today. Ed S. Evans, Brenda Hines, Hefe, uh, Cody Lake, and Ian. Uh, cool Shopper, congratulations again. Uh, Rover, Jennifer Lude, thank you for joining our show today. Uh, Randy Dresden, thank you for the help with the coupons today. That was a big help. Who got 17th place? 17th place today was... Seabass. Seabass was 17th place today. Uh, unfortunately, Seabass did not join. He left or she left. Seabass left the show earlier. So uh, Woolrich, the junior, Margaret, uh, as well as anybody else that I might be missing. Thank you so much to everyone for coming and joining Clown Live today. Uh, I love you. I'm in love with you. I'd like to go on a dinner date with all of you sometime. Uh, if you're into it, let me know, okay? Anyway, with all of that out of the way, once again, I am Dragon Blaker. You can call me Blake. This has been Clown Live, and we'll be back tomorrow at 5 p.m. with more giveaways, more products, and more information to help you and guide you through a beautiful shopping experience here on Amazon, baby. All right, uh, I'll catch you all in the chats, and I'll see you later. Okay, bye, everybody. Much clown love.